me I were young again. Just a dozen years or so. Good evening. Good evening, Doctor. Do you need... I'm afraid I... Our job brings us into contact with all kinds of infections, Milton. There's no shame in being ill while you're in a hospital. That's easy for you to say, Doctor. I get the feeling you don't fall sick often. But thanks, anyway. Goodbye, man. Hawkins. Good evening, Nurse Brannigan. Good. Do you require me? I will be. Nurse, you won't be able. I'll try, Doc. Goodbye, nurse. Ooh, Hippocratic Oath. Hey! <laughs> You're lucky to be alive. Of course! I'll leave you for now, Mr. Cox. The guy down here needs help. Good evening. Evening. Do you need? Don't get me wrong. Treatment for headache. I don't have that. I will. Goodbye, Mr. Thatcher. Try to take care. Rakesh. Is this supposed to be an ostrich? A pig stock smell bell. It's locked. Good evening. Do you need well, the pro Don't end that is a good thing. Goodbye, Mr. Chidana. I see. She became a vampire. Our scowl, level 24. Mm. Maybe we should have embraced her. We can't kill her now. Interesting. Ah, oh, there you are. The Swanborough Cordial can be the answer to all your problems. As long as you have okay, the money. What are you doing Good out evening, here? Mr. Petrat. I can ask you the exact same question, Mr. Doctor. Now leave me alone. I heard what happened to Nurse Crane. How do you feel? Mr. Petrescu. Everything was going well until you arrived. Dorothea helped people and will be sorely missed. I regret it too. I wish she'd continued working at the Pembroke Hospital. She was a good nurse. So you put an end to the operation. The 
Did you put an end to Dorothea as well? You seem to have a lot on your chest, sir. What's wrong? I heard you are a famous surgeon. Tell me, what did you do to Dorothea? She was so bright, so clever. Then you made her an empty shell. I didn't use drugs or medical trickery, Mr. Petrescu. All I did was talk to Nurse Crane. I promise you. But what happened to her then? After you left, she did not even recognize me. Then she got careless and sick, and I had to flee. Tell me everything you know about Camellia, the mute florist. I do not believe in the afterlife, Doctor, but I'm almost convinced Camellia is an angel. She volunteered to give out our medical leaflets. Tell me every- I do not believe in- How do you feel, Mr. Petrescu? Do you need my help? I would not even accept fresh water from you, Doctor. I don't need your help. Yes, you do. Please, take this. You'll feel better. I said I don't want anything. But I'll keep this for those who really need it. Goodbye. I feel like I messed up that decision with the nurse. I'm not even sure anymore. If I could get some work. Good evening. I'm afraid. Have you any no reason? You don't. Oh. I don't have treatment for migraine. I will see. A gun. Then the person from up here. How are you? I'm not your boy. Do you need please? There you go. Very funny. Goodbye, young man. Head anemia. Oh my god. Okay, can do that. Do that. Can't do this one because I don't have the cure for the migraines, so that's a problem. But other than that, I think I've pretty much healed everyone that I possibly can heal. Healthy, 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 recovering. I need a headache cure, but I don't got that. Yeah. So I've done all that I possibly can for now. There is something here. It's a mystery. Oh, no, it disappeared. Yeah, right here. Move that. Custom marker. Let's go to it. It's like a... And up to the left. Left here, right? No, one more. Oh god! Thought the game just froze on me. Oh, it's the event of. I see. I can't kill her yet. Man, game is getting janky. The event is Nurse Crane. Come on, game. There you go. All right, we will talk to Dr. Swansea now. i done all the healing, kept everyone alive. My best anyways. Best is all you can ask for, man. Up here to the right. Wow. This game is struggling. If this keeps happening, I might have to restart the PlayStation. Maybe there's like a memory leak or something. There's a level 18 guy down there. No thanks. I don't feel like getting my shit pushed in today. Shortcut.
Have for chit chat. Evening, Edgar. Could I get your professional opinion? Please speak. But I have something important to tell you. This strain of flu. It's very different from the one I saw in Europe. It's downright peculiar. Really? What makes you say that? I've just looked at the blood of one of our recently deceased. I see. Do you have anything more to go on? This disease spreads and looks like the Spanish flu, but its effects differ greatly. The London strain is different from the continental one. This is very interesting. Did you find something else? Yes. Unlike the flu, the infected begin to show an increase in outwardly aggressive behavior. More than simple agitation. Once docile people become violent. You mean like rabies? Is there a chance we could create a vaccine, Jonathan, like Pasteur? By the stove, that would be smashing. There's a lot we're not seeing here, but it is spreading and quickly. If we don't act, the whole city could be lost. But Jonathan, we've a fantastic opportunity sitting right here in front of us. A weapon of choice. What on earth do you mean? Why you, my dear boy? With your expertise and your blood, we could isolate the properties that course through your veins. Think about the possibilities. I admit it did occur to me. Blood seems to be the common factor in all of this. I totally agree. We're in uncharted territory here. Maybe it's just wishful thinking, but imagine the possibilities. We'll discuss this more later. Thank you for your time. No, thank you, Jonathan. But as I said, I needed to talk to you. I have some rather bad news. Yes? I'm afraid it's your sister. My sister? She's to be buried this evening at Whitechapel Cemetery. Your mother published the obituary this morning. I see. I'm sorry, Jonathan. Please accept my condolences. Uh. Attend Mary's funeral. Well, this is gonna be awkward. Shit. Oh well, what can you do? Continue on. I never th thought I would have to attend my murdered sister's funeral. Mary, I can't forgive myself. I'll find the truth about what happened to us. I swear. Alright, so it turns out you actually don't even go in there. Alright, so I had to restart the game because it froze. Did a hard reset on the PlayStation. Cause... Yeah. <laughs> Cause it kept freezing. So hopefully that fixes things. Looks like we gotta hide out here. This lady had what we will call rough night. Looks like these guys are gonna block my path towards the cemetery. That's alright. Oh shit, that's a lot of guys. This guy's just firing wildly. Ooh, level 16, eh? Oh my god. You son of a bitch. Shoot up. Yeah, this Sissy boy! Oh my blood. Insatiable thirst. Go invincibility frames. Throw down there. You stay there for a sec, please. Jeez. 
Jesus. Just keep coming, dudes. Big guy, are ya? I'll show you. Throw it down. Oh! Oh, please. I didn't even kill him. Yeesh. Let me just go down here real quick. See what we can find. Look at that man. Look down the hole. Oi! Oi! No! Oh thank god. It's locked. What's down here? Stonebridge sewers. Do you want to explore this now? Level 16. If the, if the guy at the beginning is level 16, then. It's only going to get harder further down, so let's just continue with the main mission. Please don't respawn those guys back in. Thank God. Grab more shillings. Shillings. There's gotta be a secret something around here. Back on the streets. Really? Nothing here? That was a colossal waste of time. Wow. Maybe something will be here eventually. Just not now. Drop on these guys. Oh, I got destroyed. Oh, we got caught me in a combo. You fancy, huh? Royce is right. Trying to prevent me from getting to my mommy. That's some grease. All right, into the cemetery we go. Mumsy. My dear sister, I don't know if I have the strength. Discreetly? Oh, 
Oh yeah, this lady? Oh my god, you son of a bitch. Wow. Jump on my back and stop pumping me like a dog. Just die. Yeesh. I gotcha, I gotcha, I gotcha, I gotcha, I gotcha. How are you doing in here? Are you alright, miss? I I don't know. Who were those people? They they wanted to kill me. Why? They've lost their minds in the epidemic. They won't come back for now. You seem to know a lot about them, sir. I'm Dr. Jonathan Reed. I'm investigating this disease. I am Xiao Shun. Thank you so much for helping me, Mr. Reed. I must go to the cemetery now. Goodbye. Goodbye. Shouldn't you? Maybe later. She's supposed to be Asian. She doesn't look Asian. At Carnage. All. Is Father Whitaker's disciple among the bodies, I wonder? This man's far too old to be Samuel. No. By the look of his clothes, this man's a docker. Samuel isn't here. I had better follow the blood trail. It's locked. <laughs> it's like a black light, man. Revealing all your secrets. As I fear, Samuel no longer preaches the good word. Samuel? Let me try moving to blunt objects here. Ow! Son of a bitch. Ooh. Samuel is tough. Fuck. Something for him. Holy fuck, you have a lot of health. Lay it on, just keep him on the stun lock. We'll finish him. One more time. Oh my god. Sad, oh. oh god. Oh god. Next hit wins.
Okay. I gotta go attend the funeral now. Lots of this. It's a freaking gauntlet just to get there. Careful. Careful. Blood. Should have made some serum before I came in here. That was close. Give me all the stuff, baby. He's itchy. He's itchy. Oh, you saw a bitch. Should I get some blood back? You die now. Again, always it always happens to me. That's where I met the widow. I have this thirst for blood. Finish him, please. Through here, Go to the left. Oh, 
god, man, it was a fight to get up here. But we made it. Since I can't reveal myself to my mother now, I must find a discreet spot to attend the ceremony. 